Hello everyone. In this short video, we are going to see how to build a traditional DevOps CI CD architecture that will deploy applications into the Azure environment without having any human intervention. Some of the key Azure services we are going to use in this architecture are Azure DevOps, Azure Key Vault, Azure Web App, Azure Monitor, Azure Insights, and Azure Analytics Workspace. Before we see the actual architecture, let me give you a very quick overview. We have an application that needs to be built, tested, and deployed into Azure Web Apps as a container. So without further ado, let's see how our DevOps CI/CD pipeline will look like. Let's say we have an application developer who just pushed his changes into a GitHub repo. As soon as he pushed his changes into the repo, a CICD pipeline gets triggered in Azure DevOps. And what this pipeline does, it first checks the quality of the code by running a bunch of tests, which could be unit testing or static code analysis or something like that. This test will require some secrets which are stored in the Azure Key Vault. At this point, Azure pipeline will grab those secrets from the Key Vault. If any of these checks failed, the CICD pipeline will stop straight away and the changes will not be deployed into our Azure environment. But if all of these tests pass, the pipeline will build a Docker image from the application code stored in GitHub repo and then push that newly created Docker image into Azure Container Registry. As soon as the Docker image is pushed into the Azure Container Registry, that Docker image will be deployed into Azure Web App as a container in the staging environment. The pipeline then runs some acceptance tests against the staging environment to validate the deployment. If those acceptance tests succeed, the pipeline will pause at this stage and wait for someone to manually validate the deployment. And if the deployment looks good, he or she will resume the pipeline, which will eventually deploy the application into production environment. In this architecture, I have also included some other Azure services for monitoring and log analysis purposes. For example, we can integrate Azure Monitor with our Azure Web App to collect logs and metrics, which can be used to monitor our application's performance and healthiness. We can also use Azure Application Insights to collect application-specific monitoring data that can be used in Azure Log Analytics. So that's how our overall CSD pipeline will look like in Azure. Thank you.